We are at a point of crisis for humanity and for the living world. Climate breakdown, poverty, oppression, forced migration and violent conflict are deeply connected. They are driven by an economic system based on exploiting people and nature to extract profit for a few. We must act now to transform our society for a just and peaceful future. The people most affected by climate breakdown should be at the heart of decision making at COP26, but very few of them will be there. So it's more important than ever that we add our voices to their calls for justice. Through centuries of colonial expansion, rich countries like the UK have done the most to cause the climate crisis. People in the global south are now facing the worst impacts of a crisis they did not cause. We owe the rest of the world an immense climate debt. So Scotland and the rest of the UK must rapidly cut our own national emissions to zero and fund our fair share of a global just transition beyond fossil fuels. We must find money for communities already bearing the brunt of climate breakdown. This means setting up an international loss and damage fund paid for by the biggest polluters. We mustn't leave this to future generations. Governments must act now. Working for a more just and peaceful world is at the heart of what it means to be Quaker. We uphold all people taking peaceful action for climate justice, whatever your contribution. On 31st October, Quaker communities will be gathering for worship, holding in the light all environmental defenders and communities at the sharp end of the climate crisis. On 6th November, we will join thousands of people on the streets of Glasgow, across Britain and around the world in a day of action for climate justice. We call on friends and all, all those who are called, called to live for truth and justice, justice to, to join, join us. us.